primary school children are training hard at this sports centre in Doha. They should be looking forward to the biggest event in their sporting calendar, the British schools in the Middle East Games. But organisers have told head teachers in Qatar that because of the Gulf diplomatic dispute, children will not be allowed to take part. Hundreds of children are disappointed by the ban, which raises questions about whether sport, education and politics should mix. It was my dream to be in BSME and I've only been to it once, so I really wanted to go to it twice, but I can't. I'm disappointed because like, I really, really wanted to go. It's gutted because I didn't get in last year and I really wanted to try get in. It's an experience. 95,000 children with 95 nationalities are educated in 106 schools linked to the organisation. 15 of them are in Qatar. The BSME website says the purpose of the Games is to provide a learning experience in sportsmanship and in the value of healthy competition. But critics say by excluding children as young as eight, the organisation is not living up to its own ideals. Organisers say they're planning an alternative to the upcoming Games in Dubai and are working closely with principals in Qatar to support the planning and running of a Qatar Games this year. This will provide the opportunity for BSME schools in Qatar to participate in a significant organised event. Parents say that while they appreciate the effort, it won't be the same. I think it's a bit of a disgrace as an expat, the way they've let politics get involved with sports uh, shouldn't be allowed, you know, and I think uh, they've got to really think about what they're doing. Head teachers in Qatar accept the decision is out of their hands, but that's little comfort for children who'd set their sights on competing in Dubai. Victoria Gatenby, Al Jazeera, Doha.